Hello, my friends. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're doing good. I hope you're ready for another YouTube video from your old buddy, Dadcraft73. We're back here up in the sky playing some 1.10 modded Minecraft, playing some of that Sky Factory. Oh, man. We've been doing a little bit of work, just a little, not very much at all since our last episode. You know, I don't want to go too crazy. You know, I have to resist the urge because I'm making daily videos. Man, we got plenty of time to do all this kind of stuff. But I have to kind of resist the urge to just go absolutely crazy and just play this for like 10 hours a day, every day. But I want to make sure I'm bringing you guys along for the ride. So we're having a good old time. I'm smelting up a little bit of iron. Man, I'm short on iron. I got, I got problems. <laughs> Anyway, let me show you what I've got so far. So off camera, all I really did was made myself another one of these integrated dynamics generators. Nothing nothing too crazy there. You remember how we make those? Generator. Let's take a look here. Where is that guy? Right there. So we just have to make a furnace, which is super easy, and an energy battery, which is a block of redstone, and some more of these crystal chunk pieces, uh, parts. So we have tons of those, and I have a little bit of extra redstone. There's nine of them oh. so <laughs> that, that actually of all the materials that I've been getting man it seems like redstone is the hardest one to get you have to use compressed dust in a, a heavy sieve and you know you have to bust all this stuff down to get compressed dust man it's a pain <laughs> that's for sure the other thing that I did is I prepared myself a little bit of crushed gravel I think that's all I've got here let me just sort this and make sure yeah all that's that stuff Okay, this guy's still working along. I had an extra piece there. Oh, do I? Is that gravel? Yeah, let's put that in there. Let's compress that up. That's one thing that I've been doing, you know, instead of reforming it in the crafting station. I mean, it's kind of lazy, but, you know, I'm usually trying to work on other stuff. So we've got 21 crushed gravel. So if we run crushed gravel through the sieve, we get some different materials, this compressed gravel. Because what I want to make today is the auto hammer. We talked about this in our last episode and you know we just ran out of time to get it done so we're gonna start off the episode doing it with this oh my goodness there's some crazy stuff there <laughs> anyway auto hammer we need no is that what we're doing yeah auto hammer we need a diamond hammer which means we need some diamonds and we need some iron ingots and a couple weighted pressure plates so we need one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so we need ten iron how many do we have i think we have nine i want to say we have nine Oh no, we have 22. Man, that's good. Okay, we can make that. So all we need is a couple diamonds. And the way you get diamonds is you sift compressed gravel through the heavy sieve. And man, we hope to get lucky. It's only like a like a 1% chance. But I have a feeling though, because we're really doing like 9 at a time, maybe it's like a 9% chance? I don't know. Let's just run this all through really quick. We'll do it on camera. You know, this is not the most exciting kind of video content, but man, this is part of Sky Factory. You're doing these Skyblock mods, man, it's just part of the way it works. Let's see, we're almost done. We've got a couple more. Well, I guess we're half done. We're getting some more iron. We're going to need that, I think, because I was looking at the auto sieve, and I think I need two blocks of iron to make that guy. So, if we could get both of those done in today's episode, man, that would be amazing. Let's just keep grinding these out. we just got five more. I'm going to take a drink of coffee while this is happening. Ah, so good. <laughs> oh, I drink so much coffee. Yeah, man, you know how it is. All right, let's see. Let's see if we got lucky. Uh, no. We got zero diamonds out of that deal. We got to get some little bit of stuff to make some iron, though. We'll go ahead and smelt that up. Let's see, we'll just stick that in there. We've got some more coal, that's good. Well, we got some other little odds and ends. We're getting tons of gold. I bet there's something cool we can make with that. We'll have to start looking at some of those things. Um, some more lapis. And what else? Uh, I guess that's it, other than this coal. Here, we'll just stick it in here with these other guys. There we go. Now we're getting a little bit of coal. So let me go off camera. I'm going to get a bunch more. I'm going to make a couple. Let me make like two stacks of this compressed gro gra gravel no <laughs> compressed that was like cobble and gravel together compressed gravel let me get a couple stacks of that 
ground up and I'll run it through the sieve and I'll bring you back hopefully we'll get some diamonds I'm gonna keep working until we at least get enough diamonds to make that hammer hammer auto hammer I will keep wanting to say hammer er oh my goodness my word sometimes good grief you know I spent the first like two or three episodes talking about building a lava generator now I keep saying hammer er er, -er. <laughs> whatever I'm a crazy guy. Anyway, let me get to work busting all this down. I'll be back with you in just a second. Alrighty, my friends. We are back, and we have been sifting like fools. <laughs> we sifted down those two stacks of compressed gravel. We ended up with five diamonds, which isn't too bad. We got some other little odds and ends. We got some... These I just got out of my uh, chest a minute ago. But we got a bunch of uh, iron ore. We've got some coal. We got some gold ore pieces. We got some more nickel. I say we should go over here and just throw them in. Just so we can clear out our inventory a little bit. And we may be a little careful. We might be running out of space. Gold. And then coal, I think, right? Yep. Awesome. Man, I'm really happy with getting those five diamonds. Now we can make our auto hammer. Oh my goodness, this thing's going to be awesome. So... We need two, four, and then ten. So we need a total of ten iron ingots. Let's grab those quick. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. So we got ten of those. Let's go over here and make two weighted pressure plates like that. So right now. <laughs> right now, what? Hello? And we're going to do that like this. And we'll go and make this. Oh, wait. Um, actually, let's take all that stuff back out. Dang it. <laughs> Let's make our diamond hammer. That's the first thing we want to do. I mean, it feels like it's a you know, it's a, a big investment there in diamonds, but whatever. Man, you know how it is. We're gonna get before you know it, we're gonna have tons and tons. And just like that, the auto hammer is one hundred percent complete. So let's stick this guy. How's this guy doing? Okay, we can stick it here maybe. He gets some RF. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, he's starting to fill up. Now I think it's just as simple as taking some cobblestone, let's take one of these guys and stick them in there and it should just hammer him down. Look at that little hammer going to town in there. <laughs> yeah boy, that's awesome. So now this thing's working, it's kind of slow, looks like there's some hammer slots here. I have a stone hammer, no, yeah I was thinking probably there are diamond hammers that go in there. Let's make a couple sticks. Let me just make sure that our auto sieve, yeah, it doesn't require any diamonds. Okay, so we can use these diamonds that we've got to make a hammer, and we'll stick it in that guy and upgrade the speed. I guess technically we should try to get two hammers, but we're a little bit off from that. So we should be able to click that in there. Yeah, look, now there's two of them in there. <laughs> That's so cool. And we're getting gravel, so we're just going to let that ride for a while. You know, maybe what I'll do is I'll take a stack of this stuff, and we'll go like this. Now, how are we going to get gravel in there, I wonder? Uh, you know what we could do? I wonder. Hmm. What was the recipe for that cobble generator? Cobble. No. Cobble. Cobble generator. Uh, oh, so just lava buckets and a little bit of glass. Okay. I think we can make that. Oh, do we have lava? No, we took down our crucible. <laughs> oh, man. I tell you what, let's, uh, let's make a chest. Let's do this. Let's make a chest. All right, let's go over and get five pieces of iron, and we'll just make ourselves a vanilla hopper. We'll do it like that. Yeah, it's no, no worries. We can go vanilla on this thing for sure. So let's make ourselves just a vanilla hopper, stick that in there, like a so. And then we'll just, for now, we'll just stick that guy on top. Can we put him on top? Yeah. And then we should just be able to put cobblestone right up there like that. And it's feeding in there. Awesome. So we'll just let that run. You know, this thing has, what, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 20 inventory slots? Yeah, that's going to work like a dream. I guess maybe we should make another chest... Do we have some more wood? Let's go grab some. Let's make another chest and put it on top of that thing. Just so we have it. Let's get another one of those. And then we can just stick a chest up there and load it up with cobblestone. I don't mind being doing some of that manually. That's not a problem for me. I'm not worried about it. So we can go put that guy right up there. And we can just dump the rest of this in. Whoops, not that. <laughs> there we go. Awesome. All right, man, that thing's going to town. All right, let's take a look at this auto sieve. Let's go. Over, oh man, I hope I didn't use all the 
Let's go ahead and get some of this out of here and we'll get whatever we've got left. Yeah, that's not going to be enough. Dang it. We got too crazy making that hopper. That's okay. Let's make up some of this like that. Nope. How about we do it the right way? All right, we'll make these. And we'll make these. There we go. We'll just stick them in there, let them cook up. And while that's doing, I made a couple. I cooked up some stone right here. And I think I need to. I'm going to make a stone, a couple stone barrels. Stone barrel. Yep. There's just a couple things that I want. So we need to make some slabs. Okay, not a problem. We'll make just six slabs like that. And we'll go like that. And we'll make, let's make a one, maybe three stone barrels. That'll be enough for now. We might need some stone for something else. And I was thinking maybe, uh, let's get some more cobblestone out of here. Like so. And let's make a couple stacks of slabs. Yep. And then I want to try this. I'm going to try to make one of these wands, a stone wand. And let me see if I can go out here. Maybe we can expand our area. We're going to get into some some things that are going to be burning. And man, I don't know if wood is the right <laughs> the right material. So let's just run a row of this stuff down along the edge. Okay. Man, I don't even know how we're stayed up. We're staying up there. Okay, let me see. Can we do like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's going to be much better. We'll just extend this platform out a little bit. Uh, we'll just do two. Okay. That's good. We'll do that. Man, that's going to make building this platform so much easier. Let's go over here and do that. Looks like that wand's got a pretty good number of charges in it. I guess we can go here. Then we can just go like that. Okay, and then we'll turn around and go back the other way. That way we don't have to crouch awesome all right how many of these do I want to go out maybe um one two three let's go out let's just go out five for now let's go out five and then I'm gonna while that iron is cooking up so we can make our auto our auto sieve let's make something out here so I'm gonna get we'll just make a cobblestone ring I'm gonna try something so I don't know if this is gonna work or not but I'm pretty sure um, that's probably good. We just want like a four by four little space there. Do I have some torches? I do. Let's just put some torches out here. We're getting big enough now where we might have some mob spawns. I mean, obviously we don't need that many, but that's fine. We should actually, while we're messing around here, do we have uh, a couple more sticks? Yeah, can't we just do like this? <laughs> we'll use our berries that were eaten to make a couple more torches. And we'll just stick one out here on the end here. I gotta eat something. Just make sure. We don't want any bad guys spawning around here. Let's just spam these around a minute. Okay, let's get our food back on our bar here. Let's eat something. Awesome. I guess we could sleep through the night, but we're okay, I think. Alright, so now I need a couple dirt blocks. I have dirt blocks? No. Okay, so I just need four. One, two, three, four. And I think if I come over here and I put this dirt down like that and then I hit it with these guys yeah it turns into my ceiling that's exactly what I want because I need some witch water <laughs> oh no not that kind of witch uh, this kind of witch water so I need some witch water and to get that I need to have a bucket of water or in a stone barrel that's I guess sitting on mycelium or maybe it has mycelium around it and then we get some witch water because what we want to do with that is I want to make a couple things and the main thing is I need some quartz so we need some of this and to get some quartz we need to be able to sieve soul sand and to get soul sand we have a piece of sand in a barrel full of witch water <laughs> that's so cool this should spread if I remember correctly on how that works so we want to make sure that we save at least one of those. We got a couple stone barrels. Maybe we'll need to wait until that spreads a little bit. And then we'll see if we can't make some witch water. I think I have some sand as well. I may have cooked it all up in... Oh, I do have some sand. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I want to want to get some soul sand and see if we can't get a couple pieces of nether quartz. Because the thing that I want the most right now... I mean, there's lots of things that we need. We need different sorts of automation and stuff like that. How's this doing? Perfect. 
but one of the things that I would really like to have is a drawer controller for that and if we look here at this guy we need to make two comparators to make that happen the rest of it's just all basic materials we do have an extra diamond but to do that we need a piece of nether quartz and the only way to get nether quartz is to bring get it out of regular sand can we just do like a regular sieve yeah regular sieve and it's still a 33 percent chance so we can just sieve it through a flint stiffened mesh <laughs> oh yeah did it spread yet no all right let's take a look at our iron it should be cooked up awesome good enough let's make this auto hammer auto auto sieve okay so at some point we would like to make the the heavy one but we can't yet so we need two iron blocks we need some glass plane panes we need a regular sieve not a problem we have one of those and I think we might as well just get that flint mesh out of there just so we can use it down the road whenever we get some some of that uh, soul sand all right there's one iron block there's second one okay Do we have glass panes I think I have some in here somewhere uh, glass panes no I don't have any glass panes okay we will make some not a problem we have glass okay so it's like this right the sieve goes in the middle these two guys go up here and this guy goes right there awesome now we have an auto sieve as well and let's just for now set this guy down here does he need power he does he needs power and a mesh so we can put that in there flint stiffened now I did make this generator offline off camera made another one of these guys I don't think these are the best <laughs> I mean I think they're really to be used for this integrated dynamics mod but you know we're using them whatever we're good let's go grab some coal and we'll just stick it in there how about uh, yeah, we'll get that much might as well just stick it all in there like that now it should be producing some power and it should be coming over here it is awesome filling up nicely so we got that in there and we can now put let's actually put these couple pieces no <laughs> actually let's get some gravel out of here how about we do that we'll just stick that in just like that and it should go to town there's a little dude in there who is it Dustine is in there going to work now I read somewhere that if we give them some food <laughs> yeah I think it speeds it up yeah yeah they're going to town now so we're just gonna let that run through why not right actually let's get the rest of this stack out of here and we'll just put it all in there awesome so let's let that run we'll see we'll come back to that in a little bit and see what we end up getting look at that man all of our mycelium spread that's awesome I'm kind of thinking I should break out one of these blocks like that no, we don't need and I just want to make sure that we save a piece of this mycelium I wish I had some kind of silk touch but obviously we don't have that <laughs> we're a ways away from any kind of silk touch but let's just go ahead and put that there goodbye cobblestone and then we can put these guys these stone barrels down I don't think they damage the ground but you know just in case we'll just make three we'll go like that and now let's get our bucket which we have somewhere there we go there's our bucket actually let's get all of these buckets why not and we'll fill these up with water okay then we can go over here and dump it in this thing and let's see if it turns into this witch water stuff and theoretically it should I don't know if we have to wait a little while or what yeah transformer you can see it's doing that right now so yeah they're working on that awesome hmm <laughs> that's so cool let's take a look here at what's going on man we're getting some different materials that's awesome man we need like a whole army of those things and we need to get to a point where we can get other types of materials and that would be awesome okay so drawer controller we need two uh, let me see how much redstone do we have we have nine that's enough right so we're gonna need six pieces of redstone we need six uh, do I have sticks no uh, we, we're gonna need six redstone torches and then we're gonna need to see if we can't get some uh, let's use there, let's use jungle wood why not we're just making sticks so let's do that and then we need six redstone torches like so awesome so we're gonna need those to make those comparators I would let man when we get that drawer controller we're gonna be set almost done 
you know, why is it that whenever I'm usually recording these episodes, man, it's like pouring down rain all on our heads. <laughs> and then when we need the rain, it's sunshine, it's clear sky. All right, almost done. Okay, what do we need to put in there? Sand, which we have. Okay. Awesome. Oh, we got some mushrooms growing there. That's kind of cool. I might be able to use them for something. All right, so that, that, and that. Okay. All right, let's go grab us some more water. Maybe we should make an infinite pool over here. I bet we should. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do that. Let's get these two guys... We'll make ourselves an infinite pool right over there, just so we have one. Um, we'll just do like this. Okay. And we can put that guy in and then get this other guy, just so we can constantly fill the... Oh, that wasn't very smart. Put this over there. There we go. Okay. That's full now. That's full. That's full. Perfect. Perfect. You know what else we should do? Um, let's take one of these. Can we get this off here? <laughs> Why not, man? We're crazy. We're doing all kinds of crazy stuff. All right, so let's get this guy, and let's just hang it over here on this side. How about it? Let's just put it right there, and we're going to put... We'll use this clay bucket. We'll just stick it on there. There we go. So if we need to get some water out of there to make some witch water, we can use that bucket, because I can promise you I'll come running over here, and I won't have a bucket with me. So I'd like to get a couple more pieces of sand. Let's get in here and get, uh, I don't know, half a stack or however many this is, 27 gravel. And let's just bust it into sand really quick. And we'll vein mine it so it'll happen really quick. All right, we'll use this guy. Let me see, here we go. All right, there's all our sand. Got 31 pieces. These guys almost done. Oh, get out of the water. Okay. All right, awesome. So here's what I'm going to do. Let me go off camera. I'm going to grind out a little bit more soul sand. I'm also going to see what I need to do. Eh, I don't know. Let's just, let me just go off camera and get some soul sand. And I'll come back on the other side and we'll see if we can't get this drawer controller going. That's going to solve a lot of our issues. Let me get that done. I'll see you in just a second. Alrighty, my friends, we are back. Man, I've been doing a little bit of work off camera just between whenever I've been just, oh, hello, <laughs> filling these up with water and just to converting them into soul sand. I busted up a whole bunch of dust and I've just put a bunch of it here in my auto sieve. Man, I'm trying to get some redstone and it's gone through a stack and a little bit more and man, no redstone. <sighs> man, I never thought for a, in a million years that redstone would be like the big you know, the big leveler, <laughs> you know what I mean? So, oh my goodness, it's gonna, we need to get a better source of redstone ASAP. But anyway, we do have 27 soul sand. <laughs> I had to recount that just a second. And we need a flint stiffen mesh. Uh, what's in there? Okay. Um, I thought I had a flint stiffen mesh, but I don't, but that's okay. Um, I think we can make one really quick. Let's see what we need here. Uh, flint stiffen mesh. So we need four pieces of flint. Not a problem. I think you can just use some gravel, and we happen to have a bunch. So let's go ahead and go like this right here, and we get some flint. Awesome. Um, I don't know what to do with this. Let's put this in there. <laughs> Why not? Okay, do we have some string? We do. All right, so we need a flint stiffen mesh. We'll make that really quick, just like so. And then I'll notice that I have one actually in my inventory. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> I got it out so I could use it and then I didn't see it. All right. If we shift click, we can get the old one back. Let's put this guy in there. All right. Now we got to sieve this stuff in hopes. Let me just make sure one more time. Okay. In a regular sieve. No. Flint stiffen mesh. Okay. Flint stiffen mesh, we have a chance to get nether quartz. And we just need two pieces. And of course, that's a heavy oak sieve. All right, well, that's not a problem. We can compress and get three. Oh, this makes me a little nervous, but that's okay. Let's see. Come on, baby. Come on, quartz. <laughs> yeah. First piece, we got five pieces of quartz. Let's just... Let's, oh, I guess we have to run it through now. That's okay. 
We can always make more. All right, we get 19 pieces of quartz out of that often. Do we get anything else? No, but I don't I don't really care. <laughs> All I really wanted was that quartz. Let's go get these pieces out of here. Let's make, oh no, actually it is this stuff we have to use, I believe. We have to use, you know, one of these, these deals. So let's go like that, and then we'll put this right in the middle. Bang, two comparators, awesome. A little bit of quartz to spare. We'll stick that in there. Um, yeah, we'll stick these other things in there quick. All right, I need my stone, though. I got that. Let's put that there. And my diamond. Okay, so drawer controller. Uh, controller. Should be this guy right here. And we need a basic drawer, which we need to get some wood for. That's okay, because we're going to upgrade a lot of these drawers anyway. You know, I might swap them out. So, uh, let's get there. We'll get that many. <laughs> convert those all into planks all right how much okay all right let's make some chests let's make actually more than that there's three let's make one more let's make four chests okay so drawer controller we need some sort of drawer so we can make we don't want that one we want the drawers that are two by two like we have now basic drawer two by two okay let's do that and we get that okay and now this goes in the middle this goes at the bottom these guys like this and I think the rest is stone look at that drawer controller awesome and we have three extra drawers which is awesome so we can go now it'll interact with drawers on 12 12 on each side so man this is going to be perfect so we can just go like this this and this awesome so we've got our drawer controller and what that allows us to do so I'm sure you guys know all about it already but in case you don't you know once you have the drawer controller you know so if we click on this chest right here you know with this redstone it goes in there right no worries at all but if we come over here and we get I don't know let's get a stack of this nickel ore what we can also do is just come right over here and double click on that and it takes it out and puts it in the appropriate drawer which is so much better than doing it, you know, running around, clicking on all the individual drawers. Awesome. Drawer controller complete. Now we can fill out a little bit more. It looks like we got one, two, three, four. Yeah, we can extend it out on both sides. We can have a whole bank of drawers here. We can swap these out for some of the bigger ones. Oh, that's awesome. So essentially, we have our initial storage system. Man, it's set up and ready to go. Look how awesome we are. All right, there's one more thing that I want to do in this episode before we're said and done. I need to get some clay because I think I have bone meal. I think I have like a good bit. Let me see. Oh, yeah. I have like a stack of bone meal, which is perfect. How's this guy doing? Oh, we got a piece of redstone finally. Nice. Yeah, it's working out okay. You keep on, little dude. Oh, man. I, <laughs> I went over here and clicked all my food in this thing. Let's get a stack of that out. Gotta be careful about that. I should, well, no, those are a crafting resource, too. All right, let's feed this guy. There's a little bit of old dustine. <laughs> oh, there's some more bone meal coming. Awesome. So what I need is I need to make a bunch of magma crucibles uh, or lava crucibles. So if we go here, actually, I guess they're just crucibles. So we need to get an unfired crucible. And remember, we did this at the beginning. We have one already, but we need a couple more. So I want to have, like, maybe four so I'm gonna need a bunch of clay so I guess we could just go make that I mean, we're getting close to the end of this episode and I want to make sure that we're not running over you know I don't want to just start a project and not be able to get it finished but I bet we could probably come close to at least making these guys before we're all said and done and we put oh uh oh um, that's okay let's make uh, a couple more stone barrels quick uh, where's my stone? I still have it in my inventory. But I don't have slabs. Let's grab those. Okay. So let's make two more stone barrels. Because we're going to need them for other stuff, I'm sure. And we'll just go like that and like that. Okay, cool. And then we can just set these guys. Maybe we'll... Uh, I don't know. We'll just set them uh, right here for now. That'll work. Alright, let's get some water. We can fill that up. Then we should be able to just do dust and dust and get clay. Awesome. 
because we're going to need these for whenever we start doing a tinker smeltery, which I think we're going to start off with next episode. Well, I think maybe next episode we might do, we might start out with uh, something a little different. Okay, so we have a bunch of clay now. We can just put all that down on the ground. Okay, get our hammer out, and we should be able to just vein mine all this stuff. Yep. And we got tons of clay, so we need seven. Yeah, that'll make us three. Awesome. So let's get out of here. Uh, 21 bone meal. Awesome. And we'll go like that, and we'll go like that, and we'll keep that. Yeah, we've got a use for that. Don't don't you worry about that at all. All right, we now we have three unfired crucibles. We can stick them in there. We'll smelt them up, and then we'll have a total of four. Because what I want to do, since we've got a little bit of wood or a stone out here, I think we need to set up some lava generation. I was looking around off camera to see what I could do as far as power generation. I mean, these things are really cool, but I don't think they're going to be good for like long term. And the other thing is it looks like they have like a weird priority. Like it fills this up and then it like, I don't know. <laughs> it's kind of weird how it works. So we need to get some true power generation. And so what we're going to do is make a couple magmatic generators from extra utilities. They're pretty cheap. We need a bucket of lava. We need a furnace generator, which is just iron and a machine block. So there's a fair amount of redstone required here. So we're going to have to work on that between the episodes to get a bunch of that. A lava bucket. Gold is not a problem. So none of this stuff is a problem except for the redstone. I wish there was a different way that we could get it. I mean, there are some other ways. Yeah, we're not going to be able to do that. Uh, mana infusion, loot bag, stuff like that. Yeah, so I think maybe next episode. I don't want to go too long. I think I'm already long already in this episode. Just jibber-jabbering. So I think next episode... We're going to see if we can't, between the episodes, I'm going to grind out some redstone, get that done. And then I guess in tomorrow's episode, we're going to do a little bit of work to set up a lava generation thing. And then we'll get started on some tinker stuff. That'll be pretty cool. Not too bad for we what we've done so far in this little series. Man, I've been enjoying it so much. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, please remember to be cool. Don't be a fool. And from the sky, where... We're auto-hammering and auto-sieving our way to the future. I love it. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you next time.